Now then YouTube, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kurt and today we're opening two boxes of Toon Chaos. If you didn't uh, check out the last video, the one box opening, that was a crazy opening. We pulled one pot of extravagance, one of the equip spells and also a collector's rare Cyframe Gear Gamma, I think it's called. So I do have the, probably can't see this, I do have the top loaders on hand just in case we pull another collector's rare but a collector's rare in your first box is pretty i feel like i was pretty lucky with that um but hopefully we're here trying to pull some tunes i'll pull this guy tune by the soldier so please wish me some luck and give this video a like so let's get into it i know a lot of people are pretty disappointed they didn't pre-order this set because it's been pretty difficult to find and if you can find it it's usually like off the charts of standard prices of a booster box but look at that I will admit this font kind of looks a bit like toonish, but I guess that's the point. <laughs> sorry about the lighting, sorry about the camera, but it's the best I have at the moment. Oh, come on. This box doesn't want to open. That's a good sign. Here we go. Second Toon Chaos box. Please go check out my other videos. And let's get right into it. Which side? Okay, we've got a pot of desires off the bat. Cool. <laughs> Rare. Cast for Envoy of the End, it's good signs. Status Dragon and Envoy of Chaos. That's Sacred Soldier. Where's the foil? Foils at the end. Okay, we've got Super Rare Microcoder. It's good reprint because it was only released in the Legacy of the Duelist Switch game. We'll put our supers here. I think I only pulled one of those in one box, so a little bit of a ratio, bit of a ratio information you might get from this video. Code Generator. I better slow down here because I don't want to hurt the cards. Give read. And Master Hero Acid, Super Rare. Cool. Got some must heroes in this set. I think I'm only missing one of them. Was a must? Was a must hero in Ultra? I can't remember. Envoy of the beginning. It's crazy to see these powerful cards as just rares. No commons in the set, just rares. Tomb and Happy Lady. That completes my playset. Very cool. Very nice to have a tomb card here. We're also looking for the Chaos cards. Chaos Daedalus and the Chaos Creator. That guy on the pack. And that spell, that Chaos Space or Chaos Zone, whatever it's called. I can't remember what it's called, but that's a pretty good super. That's also a very good reprint, Bamboozling Gossip Jar. Only one printing in Battles of Legend Relentless Revenge. Hope you're all doing fine. Hope you're all having a happy time. <laughs> Hope you're all having a good time. Sadus Dragon. Hope you've been enjoying my uh, resurgence of making videos. Fluffle Angel. <laughs> That's all I have to say about Fluffle Angel. I don't know anything about it. I know it's not one of the most priciest supers. I think uh, some of the prices of the rares are going down at this moment. Toon World, I think more people are opening this box. Light Pulsar, Chaos Emperor, Last Hero, and we have a Valkyrie Sigrun. So yeah, I think this was a OCG promo card. Valkyrie support. We need reprints for them Valkyrie cards. What is it? Mischief of the Time Goddess and Ride of the Valkyries? Those two, too expensive, you know? From uh, Shadows in Valhalla, Scythe Robe, Gemini's, and Sublimation Knight. Okay, this was uh, four or five pounds, I think, at the time, and I think it's gone down. I think it's going down right now, as we speak. Although I only pulled one in the last box. Crossover. Some of these Gemini cards. Scythe Robe, Gamma, that's a good rare and possibly a... Yes! Go the Chaos Space, yes. So if you haven't heard about this card, it's pretty crazy. Send one light or dark monster from your hand to the graveyard to add a light or dark monster that cannot be normal summoned a set from your deck to your hand. And there's like a whole list of cards that fall into that category. With a level from four to eight and with a different attribute than that of the monsters. You can banish this card from your graveyard, then target one of your banished light or dark monsters that cannot be normal summoned a set. Place that monster on the bottom of the deck, then draw a card. So it's got some draw power, it's got some search power. I'm going to sleep it up because I think that's a £9 super. And I'm not sure if it's a short print super, but hey, awesome. That was one I was missing. I was very disappointed not to get it, but here we got it. Let's get two more of those for a Chaos deck. No Ultras yet. Is this an Ultra? No. Fright for Meister, but more Cyframe Lord, Cyframe Gamma. Time frame Gear Gamma, which was the collector's rare I pulled in the last box. Spoiler. 
Solid Soldier, good. Solid Soldier, good reprint. Mud Dragon, good reprint, even though they were tin promos. Oh, here's our first Ultra. Infer Noble Knight Renard, which is one we didn't pull. And I think it's uh, probably going to increase in price, um, especially when Infer no Noble Knights fully come out in the Rise of the Duelist set. If you control a Fire Warrior monster, you can special summon this card from your hand. So straight, it's a bit like a hand trap there. It's a one star Fire Warrior. If summoned this way, treat this card as a tuner. Okay, so it's a tuner. You can only, if it's uh, special summoned, if you control a Fire war Warrior. You can only special summon one Infernoble Knight Renard once per turn this way. If this card is special summoned, you can target one of your Fire Warrior monsters or one of your equipped spells that is banished or in your graveyard, except Renard. Add it to your hand. You can only use this effective. So, equip, Marius, <laughs> equip monster, equip warriors are coming back. The Noble Knights are just gonna go sky high. Potentially. Uh, Masked Heroes. Can we get another Ultra right next to that Ultra? Pot of Desires. And another Toon Happy Lady. Cool. Lovely. And this side. Let's go. Toon Black Buster Soldier. Come on. That's our first Ultra. I think you're oh, at least two Ultras per box. I got two Ultras last time, but I also did, a, did get the Collectors. So I've seen some boxes with three Ultras. And, and a Collectors Rare. So like four. Four big cards, you know. Psy frame Gamma. Nice. And a Magician of Hope. Another OCG promo import. What's coming on with that? It's a little dink on the end there. Tomb World. Which of the Black. Status supervised. I'm asked here at Acid. But there's a dink on the end. I didn't do that, did I? I'm gonna pull in the pack open. Let's be careful. Be very careful with your cards. Vapor, Light Pulsar, Batflare, Rugwheel, and Evocator, Evocator, Evic. Kinda sounds uh, like a beautiful language, doesn't it? Like uh, French or Spanish. There's another Gemini fire support. Sorry about the glare, I'm gonna have to move him over there. That didn't mean to rhyme, but hey, here we go. Some more cards for y'all. Solid Soldier. Oh, Dragon. It's an Codec and Toon Terror. I think that completes my playset of this Counter Trap. And I'm not sure if this is a play three, but it's a very powerful card. If you have Toon World on the field. And the Toon Monster. So, kind of... Yeah. Gotta keep that Toon World on the field. And I found out that Toon Kingdom is not getting a reprint in Season 1 of Legendary Duelist. And it wasn't in this set either. So we're all fingers crossed for Dragons of Legend, uh, the one with the dice, reprint set. Chaos Sorcerer, and the Chaos Creator, beautiful. Thunder effect, cannot be normal summoned to set, must first be special summoned from your hand by banishing one light and one dark monster from your graveyard. If you control this card that was special summoned from the hand, you could target three banished monsters with different names, special summon one of them. Then place the rest on the bottom of the deck in any order. You can only use this effect once per turn. So this is currently getting put in a new revitalized Thunder Dragon deck that people are playing. So yeah, this guy is actually a good card. Chaos Creator. And that is our second ultra rare. Can we get third? Can we make it a uh, Tomb Blackluster Soldier? I thought that was going to be Tomb Blackluster Soldier to be honest. Or is it going to be a part of Extravagance? I can't expect two boxes, two extravagance, that's that's too much. That's greedy. Just like the pot of greed. Heroes, Eternal Chaos. New Chaos Trap. Awesome. Good to see the Chaos cards. Got the Chaos Space. Got the Chaos Creator. New Ultra Rare that I don't already have. Pretty cool. Cyframe Driver. Oh, oh, oh. Didn't expect much. And Eternal Chaos again. So double eternal chaos. They're weird. I do I know you get some uh right next to each other, really? Okay. Let's see what we got. Sublimation Knight, second one of those. I think Chaos Creator's chilling at the $30, 30 pounds range. 30 to 40. Just trying to give you guys some idea of the value of some of these cards. Renode might be at the $20, 20 pounds. We've got a few packs left. Can we get a third ultra or a collector's rare? I don't think there's going to be a collector rare this box. I just kind of feel it. Oh, what's this? 
Frank Furmeister. <laughs> I kind of geared myself up there. I saw a little bit of foiling and I was like, hmm. Could it be? Two out of two for Poetus Rose. I don't think it's gonna happen, guys. Gemini Evolution. I've been spoiled with that first Collector's Rare. Evocator, Evec. Evocator, Evec. I just like saying that name, you know? Where is it? Down there. Last pack of the first, well, my second box, but the first box of this video. Don't know if you guys wanted to see two boxes, but hey. I guess the more Toon Chaos, the merrier, right? Hopefully this fill scratches the itch if you can't find it. It's a spell, please be Chaos. Oh, Toon Page Flip, yes! <laughs> now this is definitely a $20, 20 pounds card. If you control Toon World, reveal three Toon Monsters with different names from your deck. Your opponent randomly picks one for you to special summon, ignoring its, spe ignoring its summoning conditions. Also shuffle the rest into your deck. You can only activate one Toon Page Flip, but uh, look at that, it's the Bright Castle spell card from way back in Toon World, and the page is being flipped because we're descending into Toon Chaos. Yes. So three ultra rares that we hadn't seen yet. We got an Inferno Knight Renaud, we got the Chaos Creator, and we got the Toon Page Flip. Awesome. So I'm just going to clean up here and then we'll get to the second box. Show it. I believe I'm using a wire. Oh well. Let me know in the comments what you feel about this set. Is it really Toon? Is it really Chaos? Is there a lot of padding? Should the Noble Knight, should the Geminis have been in a structure deck like they were in the OCG? I don't know. It's kind of very appealing. The uh, Toon Chaos theme, obviously, because I think fans have wanted this for so long. I'll put you up there a little bit and get into the left pack. Left side. Toon page flip. Good to see. Let's try and get a Toon bookmark. Toon bookmark. Okay, cross, crossover. Oop, nearly said cast. Gemini. Uh, first pack, Fluffle Angel. Cool. Nice to see them using different pack arts. Arts, probably booster packs. Different booster pack art. There we go. It's a way to say it. Last hero, Goku, Goka. Dark Floor, Dark Floor, sorry. Uh, oh, double fluffle! <laughs> wow! This box hates me! Be gentle. The cards. Not the kind of chaos spell we're looking for. We're looking for chaos space. Sublimation station. Sublimation station. Night. Right, come on, cards. Come on, heart of the cards. Believe in me. Believe in you. Black Luster. Chaos Emperor. Chaos. Oh, Sorcerer. What a perfect pack. What do we got? We got Chaos Valkyrie. Val Valkyria? Chaos Valkyria? Chaos Valkyria? That's how you say it? Barry? I think I pulled two of those last time. Well, first box. Uh, good to see more Chaos cards, obviously. Um, I think it's also based on the old do names, the Dark Witch, potentially, if you remember her. Let's see. Oh, it's a fusion. It's a fusion. And it's Fright First Sabertooth. Yeah, we didn't see that in the second box. Not that, uh, unless you're a super Fright Fur player, or Fluffle, or Edge Imp. That's three archetypes molded together, which I think Konami's starting to do. Mold those archetypes together for some reason. Is this a tune card? It's a pot of extravagance, baby! Oh, yes. That's uh, three boxes, two pot of extravagance. That's pretty hot. Oh yes, get in. Get in that. Look at that, pot of extravagance. Toon Chaos. That's our first ultra. You just make your value back instantly. I'm sure that's a 40, 30 to 40 dollars pound card, potentially. At the time we're recording this video, last I checked. Chaos Sorcerer. I am recording, right? Yeah. Chaos on Chaos Valkyria. Another one of those. No Toon Cane. No, no, um. No Toon Cane. No Toon Black Cluster Soldier yet. Slow it down for you. I've totally made a mess of this pack. There we go. Slow it down. Keep it. There we go. Vapor. World. 
Oh my god, it's a collector's rare. Oh! Which one? Oh my god. The extravagance times two. That's the playset, but obviously that's the collector's rare. Oh my god. That's hot. That's hot. That's too hot. I can't handle it. Let's just look at it for a second. Oh my god, that's beautiful. It's supposed to be three per case, is it? It's supposed to be three per case? Holy cow, monkeys. That's two? You pulled one in the last Toon, Toon uh, Chaos Box? Opening video? Wow, guys, guys, I don't, know, I, want to, I don't think I want to put it all the way in, but I'm going to, I kind of want to take pictures of it as well, oh my god, holy, holy moly moly moly, I'm not sure on the value of this particular one, but I know side frame gear is like 200 on eBay, 150, something like that, 140, but look at that, pot of extravagance, oh, Leak cow. That's beautiful. So it looks like. See if we can test the theory of if we're gonna get two or more ultras. A eternal chaos. You get your value back. You get your value back if you're super duper lucky. Holy dwarf star. Yeah, dwarf star dragon. I think that's what it's called. What we got? Master Hero Acid. Just uh, stack the supers there. Need some more Chaos Space in here. Oh, Magician of Hope. We have the hope that we can get a tune. Black Luster Soldier. <laughs> the search for the tune DLS is real. Stardust Dragon. Microcoda. Oh. That completes the playset of Microcodas. Cyframe. Microcoda. Okay. Double super. Getting some double supers in a row there. That's not very uh, entertaining, is it? <laughs> Hopefully, this next pack is entertaining. Let's go! Let's. Go! Ah, oh, there. My boy. The boy that I like to say the name of the most. Right, is this pack? Is this one? Is this the one? Chaos Space, yes! Number two. Let's go. Getting that second Chaos Space, I love it. Okay, it's just a normal spell card, but yeah, it searches. It searches for Chaos decks. Got the Chaos Creator, happy with that. Pot of extravagance though. Let's go, pack. Seven cards per pack. Witch of the Black Forest takes you way back to the days. Toon Happy Lady. Oof. I saw Toon, I saw Effect Monster, and I was like, is that my boy on the pack? Toon version of my favorite monster. Let's go. Come on. Sangam Valkyrie Sigrun. We're in our packs here. We do have the extravagance. It's too extravagant. This this opening, this set is too extravagant. I can't deal with it. I can't handle it. Oh, they're in the same! There's one after the other. These packs, they're not shuffled. Sangha. Oh yes, that's a place set of Chaos Space. Get in. The cards I wanted. At least we got some of those. We got three chaos space. I'm happy with that. Start building that chaos deck. Come on. Ultra rare now. Ultra rare. You owe me an ultra rare. Ah! Acid! Temple. Ultra rare now? Don't tell me it's one ultra rare. And a collector's rare. Sorry about the focus, guys. Oh, oh, that's a monster. Ah, oh, it's right there. <laughs> Fluffles and Fright Foes. No offense to those people who love those cards. Is it 
spell. Is it the bookmark? No, it's the throat. It's the same card in a row. You know, these were pre-ordered boxes. Uh, must be Europe, yeah. I think these are from the same case, as far as I know. These two. Um, here we go. Oh, it's the equip spell. Dang. Well, we got two of those now. Possibly the least valuable ultra in the set, but I could be wrong. And you know, the, the equip monster, the Gemini, the flame nobilites could become meta and this could just shoot up. You never know. Hold on to it. Oh, we got one last pack, but that's a pretty epic opening, you know? Just those three right there. That's probably what we're gonna get. Two ultras and a collector's rare extravagance. Holy, holy Yu-Gi-Oh's. Yu-Gi-Oh's -Oh! Yu -Gi -Oh! for breakfast. This is the last pack and it's Toon Terra. At least we got a Toon card right at the end. Okay, to recap, first box was a Toon page flip which is a quick play, summoning without conditions from your deck. Your opponent randomly picks one for you to shuffle. I mean, one for you to special summon, ignoring its conditions. So it's a bit like Bingo Go Go, but in a quick play. You've got a boy that special summons from the hand if you've got a Fire Warrior monster and he becomes a tuner. You've got the Chaos Creator, which can take three of your banished and special summon one of them, something like that. But remember, we've got the play set of Chaos Space, which searches depending on if you want a light or a dark. You got the equip spell, the super magic sword of Reptinius, which unlocks, uh, it lets you normal summon a monster, so it lets you do Gemini stuff. It has different effects depending on attack and defense position. You got a standard ultra rare pot of extravagance, which is our second, and we have a third pot of extravagance. A crazy collector's rare. And I don't know, I don't know what this set is, you know, it can be, it's just crazy. Yu-Gi-Oh has got a little bit crazy. A little bit, and I think Toons may be the embodiment of that. So here we go. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a like, share it with friends, uh, people you know who might like it, and subscribe for more Yu-Gi-Oh videos. I can't promise they're going to be as crazy as this boy right here, but... Uh, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.